education played a huge role in my life. While I did my high school in Congo, I had never been exposed to a higher level education setting. So one of my goal coming back was to have that experience that I never had. And so I chose to come to the school where my dad studied at. And now my sister is going to the same school to get her bachelor in accounting. So come with me as we visit ESA. Leave a thumbs up. This is a disclaimer. I don't want to leave you with a narrow-minded view of a higher education in Congo. This is just one school among many, and I will mainly focus on the classroom setting. Please subscribe, leave a comment, like. One of the similarities that I found here in campus was just the trees, the landscaping. This is such a university type of vibe that you even find in a western world. So it was just one of the similarities that caught my attention and I wanted to highlight it. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't get a chance to visit all the school facilities, but this is just like one of the classrooms that I just went and did a quick video. I wish it was more broad, but just bear with me. This is just going to be very brief. Là, anglais, il s'agit anglais. Il s'agit anglais. Il s'agit anglais. I couldn't help myself. It reminded me so much of high school and a bit how the classes was delivered. Except we didn't have microphone. I'm guessing with a uh, medium size classroom as this you gotta be loud so it's important for them to have it this is the school biggest auditorium according to what my sister told me i like that it's well maintained compared to other classroom public school it's always such a struggle <laughs> C'est ma dernière visite à l'ISC dans l'université de Mandondo. Merci Kiriabi que j'étais vraiment embarrassée avec les amis. Euh, je suis satisfaite, bien que aujourd'hui leur professeur n'était pas là. Mais bon, voilà, c'est la vie. Donc, See you next Friday. <laughs> Donc, uh, See you what's up. See la vie. See you next time. This was a brief overview of the classroom setting of a higher education in Congo. Please let me know if you enjoyed it. And please subscribe, like, and comment. Thank you so much.